So today I have um, a Why Not Made Magnetica. So this is a company that uh, is from Canada, really good company. Uh, it's made by hand and uh, they ship it I think worldwide. So this is the, the uh, flagship Magnetica. <coughs> and I got this one in uh, the latest version that I purchased. So you could see this is, you know, uh, the it's like a roll top backpack. So uh, the reason I make this video because if you Google or YouTube it is hardly any information on the why not Magnetica. Uh, so I don't know why is that. So I just made a couple of um, other videos about uh, other Magnetica. So um, I have right here the latest version. This is the latest version with um, this kind of straps and this one right here is magnetic okay the back is mesh there's no frame in here in this one um, I have another one right here which is an old version I just want to compare it to the new version so this one this is gonna be the straps right so you see here this one has a different kind of dimension and this one has a different kind of mesh this is the new one the new one the uh, trying to um, um, implement on the latest magneticas you have the why not logo the why not logo it's a little bit in different place placement this mechanism and hardware is different this is not magnetic and this one is different as well here you have a different style and magnetic closures also this has an upgrade uh, premium upgrades which has a um, rigid uh, frame back frame the material, I don't know, I mean the material is um, it's a different color of course, but I think it's a different, a little bit maybe different, I don't know if you can see it, yeah I think it's a little bit maybe different, this one feels a little bit more soft, this is a little bit more rigid, uh, the design on the back is the same one, same design. Right, so the handle I think is the same handle. And then on the top you have the um, YKK zipper and laptop compartment which is waterproof, both. I think it's the same material as inside. So the laptop fits really good here. Um, I have a MacBook Air. This is 2021 or 2020? Yeah, 2020 version. MacBook Air. So this one fits really good and there's a lot of space, extra space here. You can fit, I think, up you know, a big MacBook or any laptop. So uh, the the bottom is suspended, but because there's no frame, you see this is it's it's a little bit. Um, it's losing the form because there's no frame. On the other hand, if on this one it has a frame, if I just put it over there, it doesn't lose the, you know, it's the rigidity. So it has good frame. Uh, then I use actually the old uh, Tombin catch or whatever the name is, just to get an extra padding when I travel, actually uh, day by day. So this is what I do. I use this one. I go and insert it right here. And then when I need it, I just go boom, and I open it. So I keep the catch inside all the time. The cachet or catch, whatever the name is. So this is inside all the time. And then it just 
you can zip it with one hand and you're good to go and then I'm gonna go on the top I go inside so they have the same um, system of magnetic magnetic system you can see here the they'll they they find themselves the magnets boom and it's self-locating and closing same thing on this one so this system is the same in front we have a pocket the pocket which is the same thing it's like a k zipper aqua guard on the top you can see here on the top that it's aqua guard and it's ykk same one here you can see again the material it feels a little bit different to the touch this one is softer this one is a little bit more rigid um, so this one has this is the standard, no upgrades, no, I didn't add anything to it, so it doesn't have anything. Uh, this one has some upgrades, you see here on the sides, this is the zipper that it's opening uh, clamshell, like the whole uh, backpack if you need it. This one doesn't have, so let's say if you open it, I open it both. So this if you go on the website and you need to custom design it to order it like this is a separate uh, thing that you got to order it from the menu so when you open it pretty much same well they had the same dimensions it's the same backpack the only difference is going to be this one is here you just open it and it doesn't have anything you just open the second one it's called premium upgrades and this one gives like more extra uh, closure on the top so when you know when you're full you want to uh, be more protected from the rain maybe or in general more protected you can use this thing and also the premium upgrades comes with uh, some web looping on the bottom see this one doesn't have it also this one has the, the straps the compression straps it's a little bit dangling, so if you're hiking or traveling, you can use these ones. Or if you have a water bottle, you can um, secure it better with the with these ones. Um, that's it. Other than that, I mean, this is the premium upgrades. So when you go inside, you have this uh, double compartment. You can access uh, with the Velcro right here if you take off the velcro I'm literally one-handed so <laughs> sorry for that so you have here the second kind of like compartment for dirty clothes or let's say if you're um, dirty clothes when traveling or maybe going to the gym or whatever you want to throw in here like to separate from the main uh, compartment uh, this is it's waterproof from both sides you have a pocket here also which is not zipped and also you have like um, they call it um, like a, a separate I don't know if you can see it um, They have right there, it's very hard to show you, but they have like a, um, a, a separate pocket. Uh, it's not visible because it's too dark. Well, anyway, they have like a separate pocket over there inside. Uh, you can store something if you want to, and then if you want to close it, you just Velcro it back. Um, if you don't want to un-Velcro, if you want to use it, um, you can use the zipper to store something so for me personally when I travel I use the zipper um, sometimes so for example when I um, one sec let me open it okay sorry so 
this is how you open it so this is the bottom so on the bottom I was storing um, my shoes right or flip-flops anything so when I need it I didn't have to open the whole bag I just unzip this part and I grab it from here uh, you can use it maybe um, just uh, to grab some clothes or anything from here if you want to like fast you know like a um, like a, use it like a pocket maybe so this is pretty much the whole thing about this backpack and this one obviously has the same uh, velcro here but there's no zipper so if you want to access on the bottom you cannot only if you you'd have to use your hand to go in on the bottom or open the whole thing you know and use the, the bottom so this one is going to be lighter because there's no uh, back uh, frame in the back and also you know there's a lot of elements that are missing the compression straps the um, closing on the top so uh, this is pretty much the, the whole thing so let's say when you're traveling what I like about this bag you're commuting every day doesn't look like a big bag and if you're traveling you can um, pack the bag really a lot up until here and it's gonna take a lot on this bag like you can pack a lot on this bag a lot a lot a lot you can travel with it no problem um, the materials are really good they use I think custom materials they made uh, the, f the finish of it you know it's handmade so it's really good finish I mean they do a really good job Think they, they offer lifetime warranty as well so and also when you travel if you take all your things from the, the backpack it becomes an old backpack that you can use it over there wherever you are so you don't need to carry like a separate backpack and also you, you know you have pretty much everything you, you can go to a coffee shop you can go to, um, to your friend's house you can go to a gym uh, you can do anything with this backpack it carries really nice it's uh, very uh, comfortable straps the back keeps you uh, not sweaty because it's breathable and also you, you see these kind of lines the laptop compartment is really really e easy to to get into the only downside is that um, it doesn't have the, um, the back frame so it's but it's not bad it has some kind of um, because of this padding it gives you a little bit of uh, space so also if you use your laptop pretty much your laptop is going to be like the back frame of this bag this one um, I actually use this one the, the old style uh, I use this one for travel and it works work really well as a, a travel bag and as a daily carry uh, ADC bag uh, so I didn't have to bring another bag another backpack with me so this is how they look it's a good looking backpack Here is an example if you don't have the back frame most of the time if you have something in one side it's gonna go more on this side 
usually with the other one back frame it sits you know steady this one because it doesn't have a back frame it leans toward one side you see on here is because there's no back frame it's very soft and the laptop comes down to the as, as close to as possible to the ground and that means that the gap that he has a laptop throw the ground becomes you know pretty much like close to the ground so and this is a, a 40 ounce um, camelback and it fits in the it fits in the bottle pocket on both sides so you see here it goes on one side because it doesn't have the the back frame I take the other one this one stands no problem even without anything it's empty it stays you know and I'd say if I want to put the the, the wall of water bottle so this is the water bottle and it fits really good it's gonna eat some uh, some space from inside but other than that it's, it fits really good and because of the rigid back it's more stable so you can lean it and it's not gonna go fall on one side so it has a really um, simple minimalistic um, in terms of pockets so <clears throat> I prefer to use this one with upgrades uh, with a back frame uh, with closure on the top so let's say if I go somewhere and it leans like this, it's just more secure not to fall down. Actually, see this one, this thing fall. I mean, this uh, fall down from the backpack right now because it's not very secure. It has a dent right here. <laughs> so this is really good quality. But that means that let's say if you are somewhere and you have a water bottle here and you're gonna turn like this you can fall down because it's not really secure even if you're trying to secure with this one it's still not going to be with a compression strap still not going to be super secure on the front you have just one pocket very simple it has a little bit of a dimension but when it's fully packed it's very hard to um, uh, to access it so um, I would suggest you use some maybe small items. I just use like a small wallet inside, like a small pouch. You can use it inside. It's waterproof. And the good thing is that when it's packed out and it's closed, it's very hard to steal it. And even if you open it, it's very complicated to go inside and grab it. So this is gonna be not easy to steal stuff from inside. Let's say if you're in a country that somebody's gonna try to steal someplace. Uh, uh, sorry, let me put my microphone so maybe you can hear it better what I say. All right, so um, overall it's a very good backpack. Uh, I would suggest you to use it as a hiking backpack, as a travel backpack, as an ADC backpack, all in one backpack because of the versatility that it has, the material, the quality that it gives you, and the simplicity as well.